welcome back to our youtube channel today so in today's video we're gonna walk we're gonna walk you through on how to create your uscis account in order to follow up with your case status check on your email check on the updates on your files and your paperwork so what you want to do is to start off by putting your type you're going to type my dot us cis dot gov so that's what you need to type in order to create a uscis account so you type my dot uscis dot gov so you click that so this is it so from here is it will tell you you're going to have a page like the uscis website it's going to pop up and you're gonna have to sign up. So you sign up, you click here to sign up and you will be prompted to enter your email address. So let's see. I enter my email right there. And I'll tell you reconfirm your email address email address confirmation and you click on sign up so this is what you're going to see so we're going to send a verification link to your email address and you want to follow from that link before you proceed okay now i'm going to go ahead and check on my link the email link that has been sent to my email address all right so i go to my email address checking on my email link from here and I should be able to see my email link good so I got my email link I'm gonna send over here okay Okay, good. So I got my email link verified and sent to my one of my accounts here. Okay, that's my email link. That's it. So here is just going to be terms and conditions. Terms and conditions. You scroll right down and you click on I agree. Once you agree, you want to create a password. Your password has to be between eight characters you know making sure you got everything right yep that's my password guys please <laughs> please could you please uh, guess out my password out there this is my password for my USCIS account creation so, all right I click I click on submit so here you will be prompted to choose a two two step verification method you want to be verified by phone or you want to be verified by maybe text whichever you're going to choose from over there so you want to, i choose to be verified by my email for my two step verification so that's it so they've sent my they've sent uh, a verification code to my email address i'm going to go back to my email address and get uh, the verification code in order to complete my two-step verification because each time you sign into your account you're gonna be prompted to send uh, to receive an a code for your two-step verification in your email address or your phone number whichever that you choose you want to choose so i've choose I've chose uh, my email so the email the two-step verification code has been sent to my email so I got it and I put it in to my account and they want to tell me okay proceed to create the account so I'm clicking on proceed so at this point you're gonna have five series of questions you're gonna have five questions that you want to set up for your verification so should you lock your email or loss uh, maybe your account password and other things they want to ask uh, 
those questions by security questions so i want to say okay my first question is that uh, what is your last name of uh, what is the last name of your favorite teacher so i want to put uh, whatever I put uh, t4 and the next question in what city did you meet your spouse I could say maybe I could say still world still water and I want to continue so oh the questions are still coming back all right so I want to put answers to my first question answer to my second question then and uh, what is the company of your first paid job okay Let's see. Yep, the website is very sensitive and you have to be pretty quick and answer your questions as quick as you can. So that which uh, the website is going to turn off. So that's why I want to be pretty quick. Okay, come over here. What is new? What was the first team? Spell okay, good. And what is the first city? Stay without your parents. That's it. Okay, so damn guys, this website is crazy. It's super crazy. It's pretty much uh, so 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 quick. I don't know why. So mm, that's it. So so you have to be pretty quick you have to really 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 be quick guys you have to be quick because otherwise it's gonna like prompt, prompt you to go back again to put uh, to do all of that again so I got it so I click on submit so it's going to ask you if you are an applicant or a petitioner right so or maybe a legal representative but i want to choose that i'm a petitioner pretty much it's your personal account that you want to create so you are not a legal representative for your case or for your account so you want to click on i am an applicant so click on submit and that's it you got your USCIS account set up and with this account you can do pretty much you can add your case you can browse your files to see the updates on your file and that's it so each time you can sign in your account you click on your case status you update on your case and that's pretty much what is uh, uh, how the account can help you guys all right if you like the video please comment or put your question in the comment section or like share and also subscribe to the channel guys because we make videos like this in order to help you guys out there help people help the public in one way or the other thanks for watching